Welcome to the Maths Made Easy tutorial on quadratic and how to graphs. So in this video we'll be looking at some example questions specifically about plotting quadratics and cubic graphs. Uh, so the first one, plot the following quadratic equation and the equation is y equals x squared minus x minus 5 and the x values that we need to plot it in are from minus 2 to 3. Now the best way to do this uh, is to use a calculator and just change the values as you go through uh, one by one. So I'll show you what I mean. So uh, if I bring up my calculator here, now you can see uh, that we have the equation x squared minus x minus five. So let's uh, use the first value of minus two. Uh, so we have, I'll put it in brackets just to make it clear. So minus two squared, so that's the first value of x, minus, and then we'll put minus two inside the brackets, and then we put minus five on the end. So that gives us our first value of one. And if we go back to the calculator, we can just change this value of minus two. So the next example is minus one. And we do the same here. So that gives us our next x, uh, our next y value, sorry, of minus three. And then we just plug zero in. Uh, so you just repeat this process over and over again until you've got all the values of y that you need. So that gives us a value of minus five. Now, if we put one instead of zero, so it's a, basically just a, a repetitive process, uh, but you can't go far wrong if you do it this way. So now we put two. That gives us minus three. And then the last one then is to put three inside these brackets. And there we go. So our last value is one. So now we just treat these as coordinates and it will allow us to plot the graph. Uh, so the first coordinate then will be minus two and one. So that's here. The next one will be minus one, minus three. So we get to minus one down to minus three, then zero, negative five, and then one, negative five, and then two, minus three. Uh, so as you can see, the graph is symmetrical. And the last one is three, uh, one, and all quadratic graphs are symmetrical. Uh, so uh, let's just join these points up now with a smooth curve. So you don't need to use a ruler here or anything. You just got to do it freehand and try and make it as neat as possible. Uh, go through all the points. And there we go. That's our complete quadratic graph. If you'd like to get some more practice with this topic, you can take our online exam. It's available through our revision platform. Uh, if you go to the test, you'll find loads of different questions, a variety of different question types, and you get instant feedback on each and every one of them. Uh, so if you're interested, then click the link below and it will take you straight there.